Hi, I have a couple of questions. First of all, I was wondering how I can use the Teams app to upload my assignments. And I was also wondering, when I get sent work as a PDF, I can't edit it. Uh, it's different to uh, when I get sent work as a Word document. So I was wondering how I can submit my work when it's a PDF. Okay, so the question is how to use the Teams app for iOS and Android and how to work with PDF documents. So as you can see, I've downloaded the Teams app on my phone. Let's go and have a little look inside. The default screen when you open up the app is your activity feed, which tells you what's been going on in your Teams, including any Teams you've been mentioned in or assignment set. Now we need to find the list of Teams you are in. Sometimes the Teams icon will be at the options at the bottom of the screen, like on this device, but if it's not there, it can be found in more options shown by the three dots, like on this device. Either way, when we open Teams, we get a list of the Teams we have been added to, which you can scroll through. Now, under each team are channels or different conversations for that team. Some teachers will have different channels for different topics. Most will probably just have a general channel where all posts go. I'm going to open the general channel for 8F Religious Education to see what they've been up to. So what we see now is the posts from that team, where Miss Shaw in this case is giving messages to you and responding to your queries. As well as this chat area, at the top there is a separate area where files shared in the conversation are stored, so you can open at a later date. However, this video is about submitting assignments, which can be found in the More options. This is now a similar look to the interface on a PC, laptop or Mac. Some instructions on what to do, followed by reference material and a place to upload your work. What is nice about this assignment is the teacher has included a blank Word document which can be opened on a phone, edited and saved. However, once saved you will return to this screen. And like always, remember to actually hand in your work by clicking on the button at the top right. Saving the work is not enough and it won't reach your teacher. But now to answer the second part of your question. What if the reference material is a PDF file which can't be edited online? For now, the simplest way is for you to print the PDF or if you don't have access to a printer, do the work on paper or in an exercise book. But teachers still need to see this work to give you feedback and targets to improve. And having done the work, you will want to know what has been looked at and feedback given. So the way forward at the moment is to photograph any work done on paper or printed sheets and submit the photographs. Because phones are probably the best way to take and send photos, using the Teams app, click the Upload Work button, then select Upload from this device, where you will have the option to choose photos already taken or take live photographs of your work. Once attached, you will return to the Hand In screen and as we said earlier, you must submit that work by clicking the Hand In button. I hope this answers both your questions. That's great, thank you.